is awkward. I really don't know what to say. So I hate being recorded and being on camera, but I felt like I had to for art side. Probably gonna look back at myself and be like, oh my goodness, so bad. It's really stupid. This isn't stupid, this is actually really fun. I should have prepared something, but I didn't because I am lazy like that. Yes, I am. I'm only doing this because Catherine threatened to beat me. I'm gonna start off with a little bit of Mr. Bean so that in four years I'll remember that uh, that funny voice that I did that was I found so funny. Or an Earhart rendition of Smoke on the Water. I'm gonna do my fish face and probably kind of stupid as well, so I'm just gonna go. And everybody thinks my brother stinks like a piece of smelly cheese. Bang. Bueno, gracias. Yes, I am a complete idiot and I know. Hey, I say, that's okay. As long as there's a breeze. So, imagine the harp. This is my lab harp. If it was my big harp, it would be like... And anyway, here's my lab harp. Strings. Smoke on the water. That's all I know. I've never heard you sing that before. <laughs> what are you talking about? Okay, you can ask Anastasia. Anastasia knows I sing that a lot. There's a penny and a piece of paper and there's nothing underneath. And I'm going to make the penny melt through the table. So. Uh, sorry for ruining your little first year I know. of memory and everything. Come on. <laughs> Ready and go. And it's gone. And it's completely gone. Because I can remember the first day that I came to ArtSci. It's funny because I, I was so excited for it to be such a big change. And I knew it was going to be a big change. And I was ready for this big change. And I wanted it to be a big change. And I, then it's a big change, you know? We were playing with giant chess and giant clue. And it was just like, what is this? What have I gotten myself into? Everyone's really, really nice and really unique, and everyone's so super talented and everything. Yeah, and there's like so many amazing people, and it's like me. <laughs> okay. I live on campus. It'd be terrible if I wasn't in a small program like this. That everybody like knows each other, and uh, it's been really good. Switching out of science was the best decision I have ever made. I just love how like you people are like me. And I thought I was like the only like crazy nerd ever, and turns out I'm not. Sometimes when certain people open their mouths, aka Young or like Mary or Nagin, you'd be like, "Holy, how did they know that? Like they're just like they just always know what to say." Writing class. Oh well, we get to listen to Dr. Browning talk about his sexual relationship with poetry and writing. We made Browning laugh a few times, which should be noted. <laughs> and next semester we have, I guess, five essays, which is going to be very exciting. Oh, good times at West End Lectures. There was just a ridiculous amount of incest and sex stories, I guess, that we've learned through West End, which I was not expecting. We've shared hours and hours of inquiry-induced pain, stress, and utter chaos. Staying up all night to write Inquiry and then sleeping through West Civ. On first year, it was like my birthday on Congrats. the day that Inquiry was due. Can you imagine that? My 18th birthday, Inquiry was due. I'm complaining. I've... No, no, it was amazing. Like, it was like the best night ever. I can't wait till the next one. Well, I'm sure I, I, I can. Long live Lovrick. Love Lovrick. Oh yeah, we get to see Dr. Lovrick's face turn red when, um, <laughs> when Sean harassed him with all those sexual comments. First exam is calculus on Monday, and I'm definitely not looking forward to that. It's the day before the biology exam. If I do not survive, well, just take a moment to remember me right now. I'm really looking forward to the next four years and just getting to know everyone better and learning more about everything. Um, Artsai events are also really fun, like coffee house and um, the Halloween party and stuff like that. Gone a little crazy, made a little love, gotten down tonight, you know. 
going to the semi-formal with no pants and no shoes. Okay, so first year fun was so much fun because, oh my gosh, I can't believe I said first year fun was so much fun. Anyway, it was. Do not point out your inadequacy. Yeah. Uh, and I'll remember like our inside jokes. Uh, the infamous Takira night. Hydrogen. If Hydrogen. I remember <laughs> this in fourth year, this will be crazy. This is for you, Shahini. Like the Matt Damon and um, <laughs> the Matt Damon Facebook group and the Ben Affleck and all that stuff. Okay, so they'll all know that I had this huge thing for. You didn't have it that huge of a thing. It wasn't though. that huge of a thing, but it's Hydrogen a little thing. is. Little thing. Dun, 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 dun. Dun, dun, dun. I think 2011 will be amazing. I think there'll be all these like cool new technologies. Flying cars of some sort, clones, you know, transplant superhuman babies. Cars that drive themselves. And hope that Holland wins the 2008 Euro Cup. Although I bet I'll be looking back in 2011 knowing that they didn't. Hopefully global warming won't have wiped us all off. Well, hopefully I'm still alive in 2011 to be able to watch this video, make it through the rest of my undergraduate alive. So, to my future self, well, I have no idea where you're going to be at. I have no idea what I want to do with my life at this point. What do you do with the B-A-S-C? What is my life going to be? Four years of college and plenty of knowledge have earned me this useless degree. At this point, I'm probably thinking of going the physics route for combined honors, but then again, I'm not sure, so. My parents and I to tell my future self that I made a really good slutty Catholic schoolgirl and Britney Spears impersonator. I want to say to my 21-year-old self, that you still have that ponytail on your head, that big mop of ugly brown thing you got going on over here. Just jump off the bridge right now because uh, your past self is going to kill you if your hair is still this ugly. I hope I'm a little taller by the end of fourth year. Okay, I hope that by fourth year I still am saying which probably. I hope when we watch this in 2011, kind of know where I'm going. If not, we're probably all in the same boat anyways. But somehow I can't shake the feeling I might make a difference to the human race. Anyway, that's it for me. Good night, everybody. <laughs> Gotta go. Bye. Good luck to all of you. Peace. See ya. Bye. I love you. I love you. Good luck. <laughs> Bye. See you in 2011. So, see you in 2011. So, peace out.